All right. All right, guys. We need to talk about this. All right, guys. So, all, all right, guys. So, all right, guys. So, now, guys, in case you don't know what happened, on my YouTube channel. So, guys, on my YouTube channel, uh, on, Nove on November 12th of 2024, I did a live stream on my YouTube channel. I okay guys, I sent the link to my YouTube friend Zach D Productions to join the live stream. However, however, guess what people? There was this guy who claimed he was Zach D Productions. Uh now now granted, uh, now granted, I'm not going to say the name of this guy in case he watches this video, but but guys, but guys, there was a certain guy who pretended to be one of my YouTube friends and and because of that, the uh, and because of that, now, now again, now again, like I now, now again, like I said, I'm not gonna say the name of who it was, but, but essentially, but essentially, to sum up, but essentially, to sum up what happened is that there was, uh, there was this troll who impersonated, uh, my good YouTube friend Zach D Productions, and, and so now, now I know what some of you guys are thinking, well. What did this guy? What did this guy do just besides impersonate Zach D Productions? So, or all, all right, guys. So, so this guy who claimed to be Zach D Productions, he would he literally said in he literally said in the comment section of the live stream. Now, granted, I deleted this live stream, but that's besides the point. So, all right, so, all right. So this, so this guy, so this guy who pretended to be Zach D Productions, uh, you know, when it comes to Zach D Productions. Again, like now, I'm not I'm not gonna get into personal details, but essentially to sum it up, Zach D Productions, he has not been having a very good year. And another and another thing another thing I uh, and another thing I will say I will say about Zach D Productions is that so when it comes to Zach D Productions, uh I will admit Zach D Productions, he has he has been having problems with his phone lately because well because of personal reasons I'm not going to get into for the sake of his privacy. So, all right. So, so yeah, guys, that's what happened. And, and, and because, and, be, and, and guys, and guys, be, because of the fact that Zach has been having problems with his phone lately, I believe the impersonator. And so the impersonator said he got a new phone number. So I'm like, okay, so, all right. So I, so I was like, okay, so I was like, okay, so because of that, I was like, okay, you know, I'll put in this new phone number because uh, the guy put it in the private chat. However, however, guys, this is where things get a little odd. All right, guys. So here's the thing that was odd. So, all right. So, all right. So the guy who claimed to be Zach, you know, you know, I got his phone number, you know, uh, and so because of it, you know, that, okay. So, you know, this guy who pretended to be Zach D Productions, um, you know, I texted him the StreamYard link to join the stream. However, however, guys, this is where things get weird. As soon as I added this guy to the stage, it did not show the guy's face at all. In fact, in fact, guess what, people? And guess what, people? Okay, guys, the only options that were available were either edit name or remove from stage. And it didn't show the person's face at all. So I thought to myself, okay, that's really weird. But then, but then, guys, but then, guys, here, okay, guys, this is where things get really messed up. So this guy who, so this guy who originally, who originally claimed he was Zach D Productions, this guy, guess what he did, people? So this guy who pretended to be Zach D Productions, he literally went in the private chat and he said some incredibly racist words that, 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 so he said some incredibly racist words that, that, that guys that I know for a fact, I know for a fact that Zach would never say that stuff. So I automatically knew that whoever this guy was, it was not Zach. But here's the, here's where things get even more messed up. Here's where things get even more messed up. Here's where things get even more messed up. All right, guys, here's where things get messed up. So, so, so all right, guys, here's where things get messed up. So this guy who pretended to be Zach D Productions, guess what he said in the private chat? He said in the private chat that it was tr that he said that it was Trolls Band Together fan 2001. However, however guy, however guy, however guys, this is where things get really weird. 
So, okay, so guys, here's where things get really weird. Now, now, now guys, here's where things get really weird. So, now guys, okay, guys, for the, for the sake of privacy reasons, I'm not going to mention who it was, but, but I'm not going to mention who it was for the sake of privacy reasons, but guess what? Guess what, people? One of my friends who, like I said, I'm not going to mention the name of who they are. Guess what they did? So, so one of my friends, guess what they literally did? They, they, okay, guys, one of my friends, guess what they did? One of my friends, guess what they did? They literally, they literally used Google location. They, they literally used Google that way because guess what, people? Uh, guess what? Because guess what, people? If you use Google, it can, it can actually tell you where the caller is calling from. And now, now, got, now, got, now, guys, now, guys, for now, guys, for, okay, guys, for okay, guys, for the sake, for the sake of pri, for the sake of privacy, for the sake of privacy. All right, guys, for the sake of privacy. Now, guys, for the sake of privacy. Now, guys, I, I am not gonna mention where this caller lives, but. Okay, guys, this is where things get weird. So this, all right. So here's where things get weird. So, all right. Here's where things get weird. So, all right. So here's where things get weird. All right, guys. Okay, guys. All right, guys. So here's where things get weird. All right, guys. Here's where things get weird. Um, the, the okay, guys. The guy who claimed he was Trolls Band Together fan. Guess what? We used Google to track where this guy was calling from. And so guys, for so guys, for so guys, for those so guys, for the so guys, for those of you who don't know, Trolls Band Together fan, guess what people? Trolls Band Together fan, he lives in Ohio. Now guys, like I said, for the sake of privacy reasons, I'm not going to reveal where this troll lives, but essentially, but essentially, but essentially guys, to sum it up, so guys, like I said, I'm not going to say who this impersonator is because this imp because the reason I'm not going to reveal the impersonator is because the reason I'm not going to reveal the impersonator is because guess what people? Here is the thing. The reason I don't want to reveal the impersonator is because here's the reason I don't want to reveal the impersonator because here's the thing I want to I want to I want to strike fear into this impersonator and here's the thing guys the guy who claimed he was trolls band together fan the guy who claimed he's that guess what he does he does not live in Ohio and here's the thing that I know I know that trolls band together fan lives in Ohio in Ohio who this guy is this guy this guy does not live in Ohio like he claims. And and guess and guess what guy and guess what guys uh now guess what guys now now granted now like guys now like I said granted granted I am keeping all this information anonymous but to, but to sum it up guess what people guess what people one of my friends on YouTube who once again I'm not gonna reveal who they are guess what that friend of mine on YouTube did so that friend of mine on YouTube. Guess what he literally did? So that friend of mine on YouTube, guess what? He so that friend on YouTube, he literally has people that can trace phone calls and they can find the address of where it's being called from. And once again, I'm not going to reveal who the troll is, but I got to but 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 I will but I will say this for the troll who is watching this video for but I will say this. But I will say this. I will say that I will say this. I will say this to the troll who, guess what? I will say this message to the guy who impersonated Zach D Productions and Trolls Band Together fan. If you are watching this, if you are watching this, I'm going to tell you right now. If you are watching this, I'm telling you right now. If you are watching this, uh, if you are watching this video, uh, go screw yourself. And guess what? And guess what? If you were watching this video, you do... If you were watching this video, you do not want to mess with me at all because I know where you live and I know who you are. So if you're watching this, okay, listen, if you are watching this, this is not a threat. This is a fair, this is a, this is a very, this is a fair warning to back, to back the hell off. So yeah, that's all I wanted to say for today. So yeah, uh, rant it over. So yeah, later people.